Uh, now, Sujiva spoke about the IMF report that has been uh, out right now, and it's in Parliament, and it's in the public domain now. This, is, this report itself is 152 pages, uh, almost touching the 160-page mark. If we went to the IMF last year, would the number of pages on this book reduced? I don't think so, because uh, the, um, the problems that are in Sri Lankan economy, they were almost there for, you know, so many decades right now. Um, fiscal side, we had all, all the time the negative fiscal balances. And uh, debt sustainability also, most of the time that was in, in serious question. Our external balances, uh, most of the time they were negative, at, at least the current account balance. Um, so, even though we have we went to the IMF for 16 times, and each and every time the IMF has given certain uh, recommendations and uh, uh, guidelines to follow, most of the time these guidelines were slipped when the economic recovery or something you know growing uh, positively in the uh, economic domain. Um, due to public agi agitation also, maybe a part of the reason, uh, Sri Lanka was uh, unable to continue with these reforms. So this time, uh, whether we have uh, gone uh, earlier to the IMF or now, it doesn't make a big difference. But the only difference I will see if we had we gone the, to the IMF in the 19, uh, 2020, some of the conditions would have been relaxed. 